could getting a six pack increase your cholesterol? Well, let me tell you a quick story from a colleague, Dr. Professor Adrian Sotomota. He was treating a patient with obesity. This man, this patient, began losing weight on a ketogenic diet, a low carb ketogenic diet. Pound after pound of body fat just fell off. The man went from being obese to overweight and eventually into the normal lean BMI range. And throughout this process, his LDL cholesterol stayed low and stable until he reached a lean, healthy weight. Then suddenly, his LDL made a sharp turn. It more than doubled. It skyrocketed. Why? Because once he was lean and insulin sensitive enough, his body shifted into a higher fat burning mode and started to use a cholesterol transport system to deliver energy to his muscles and to refill his shrinking fat stores. This is the lipid energy model, a framework that predicts strange counterintuitive outcomes again and again, like this patient's LDL skyrocketing when he lost body fat, or my infamous Oreo versus statin experiment, infamous or famous, depending on who you are, and so much more. The takeaway here isn't to label cholesterol, or body fat for that matter, as good or bad. It's to encourage deeper thinking, because too often, medicine peers through a keyhole. Let's not do that.